So now don't really ask me why I'm gonna go through and do this video, but I just kind of, I wanted to show off a little bit of the collectible, random collectible stuff. I have a lot of collectible stuff, guys. <coughs> Holy shit. <coughs> Restart. <coughs> now I don't really know why I want to do this. I just kind of want to show off all my random collectibles. I have a lot of stuff, like a lot of figures, a lot of like masks and posters and just a whole lot of random junk and I just kind of want to show it off. Now this isn't going to be every cool collectible thing that I own, but as I go around my house, I'm going to show you guys what I got. So starting off up top here, uh, we got this, uh, if, I can, if I can get it off um, this mannequin's head, uh, Walking Dead Clementine's uh, hat. It's a D for, what was the D for? It was for a sports team, I, think. I don't remember. But uh, I'm going to try to call out when I remember. Alan sent me that. I have this uh, foam wingman from Apex Legends, which is not its not anything. It's just like a solid foam piece. I bought that off of, I want to say Amazon, maybe Etsy. I have a Gorilla's Noodle Phases cup I've had forever. It, it broke a long time ago, and I just kind of glued it back together. Uh, this Alan just sent me, which is the wingman again, but it's actually hard plastic, and it does the reload inspection with this little safety switch right there, and it actually pop fires a little bit. Uh, then right here we have a foam, uh, we have a foam replica of the um, scout rifle from Destiny, which is the uh, Mita multi tool. That's what it is, which is pretty cool. It's super lightweight. It's just it's it's a cool display piece. If I can actually, uh, fuck, I'm trying to do this all one hand, and I'm also trying not to turn the camera around to myself because I just got out of the shower and my dick is out. I'm just kidding. I'm in a I'm in a tank top and PJ, so I didn't really want to go around. This is a gorilla's noodle figure that I colored uh it's the like money m-u-n-n-y i think it was money world which i got that from a loot crate a long time ago and it comes blank and you can do whatever you want to it so i made it noodle we got the best pokemon ever cubone pop figure uh toff tracer who is my quote-unquote main in overwatch even though i didn't main anybody i played everyone i just had fun playing tracer because she was an annoying little mosquito we have a uh, Majin Buu, uh, first form, we have Sergeant Johnson, we have, is this Noble, uh, which one was this in Reach? This was, wasn't Noble Six, was it? I don't remember. Uh, Yusuke's over there facing the wall because he's been a bad boy, actually, it's because his pop figure doesn't stand, because, because fucking, I hate pop figures, I really, really hate them, but I get them. Here's Piccolo with one arm, doing his special being cannon, um, Mon Kantan Shoku, is that what it is? I don't know. There's uh, the Destiny 2 pre-order from Cade 6. We have the Arbiter. We have Goku, which I also got in a loot crate. Most of these I was sent uh, from Alan. We got some G Fuel up here. We have the Kid Robot Noodle figure, which is, it's opened in the box, but it's, uh, or is this Kid Robot? I don't remember uh, who produced that one, but that, that right there is a collector, collector's item. We got uh, those little, like, melted pixel dots uh, artwork of Penny from Stardew Valley, who's wife. We have uh, Shinon from Gun Gale Online, or Sword Art, whichever. Um, it's, it's Sword Art Online, but it's also it's Sword Art Online 2, Gun Gale Online, whatever. We have uh, Bitch Boy Uchiha. We have Ryuko Matui and her, actually, uh, half of the rending scissors over here. I, I always lose it. We have Titus from Final Fantasy X. We have Ryuk. We have Dark Magician Girl, we have Hinata, the only good Hinata figure I can find. We have the Prowler from Apex. We have, um, oh god, uh, Rin, Akamu Rin Akamura, Akamura, what, what the f fuck's his name from Blue Exorcist? I haven't watched it in a very long time, so I apologize. Um, then we have Tiny Tina, her axe is somewhere. I had to actually, I know people are going to hate this, I had to super glue her still, because she's posable, which I cannot stand, for display figures, so she would not maintain her balance. Alan recently sent me this, it's like this little uh, tin display, like quote-unquote neon uh, poster sign thing, really cool, just sitting in the back right there. We have a the new old fox mask that I made back in high school, uh, the Gorilla's Almanac 2020, uh, we have, uh, this is some of my book stuff, I'm not going to go too much into that because nobody cares, but that's book stuff of mine. Um, the Gorilla's poster over there. Uh, flipping around here, an Achievement Hunter blanket that my ex made me, which I, I don't know, I still like it, it's really warm. Uh, Zone Ton Mistletoe Christmas figure, uh, figure, poster, uh, 
Hollow, Bleach Hollow mask, which I've had for a very long time. This actually was one of my first videos on my old channel to get over 10,000 views. That was a whole thing. Uh, now let's go and leave my office, because there's plenty of other stuff. We're going to get out here to oh, my bedroom for now. There's not much going on in here, I don't think. Just some posters on the wall. Uh, Kanto and Johto Pokemon map that Alan sent me. Final Fantasy X. Zontong, Gorillas, Alan's painting you sent me, Final Fantasy X. This is a, uh, you know what time it is, it's time to duel uh, clock that my ex also made me for uh, Christmas, I think. Uh, yeah, it was Christmas, I remember, because we, uh, we had a very shitty Christmas tree. Um, the fuck is That's a piece of wood I just stepped on. Uh, let's see. We got a 2D joint pa uh, painting that I did, which I don't even smoke, but it was just what's gorillas related. Well, they smoke a fuckload of weed. Uh, we had this really cool um, painting here, which if you flick the switch, there we go. All the street lamps light up. Really cool. Uh, corn tapestry I've had for a very long time. I think I got that like 2012 or 13. I don't even know what this is from, but Alan sent me that to Wall Scroll. We have the fake AH crew picture right there. Uh, let's keep going. We have the most, the rarest and most exotic item that I own, one of a kind. Genuinely, nobody else has this, and that is my beautiful bunny rabbits, Phoebe and Domino. And uh, Dylan's hamster is in there somewhere, you can aid, but uh, we have this um, tapestry. We have uh, Ryuko's, it's a wooden rending scissor. It's made of wood, it's really cool. And this is the other half. Uh, behind that is Dante's Rebellion, which again is something I've had for a very long time. That is a very heavy and very sharp sword. Those spikes at the top are very sharp. The blade itself is not. Uh, then we <clears throat> Pardon me, got some mucus in my throat. We have that whole tapestry right there. It's nothing specific. Um, here we have the Halo Reach Legendary Edition pre-order statue. Had that for a long time. Uh, Gorilla's Clint Eastwood and Tomorrow Comes Today VHS tape. We have the most recent uh, Song Machine album. Then we have the uh, Giant. I'm sorry, it's a little bit darker now. Oh, I got this thing's heavy. We have the absolutely gigantic Gorilla's Collector's Almanac, which is the same thing as the other one but fucking massive and it also comes with some like a lot of prints and stuff inside here which i'm not gonna go dive into but yeah whole lot of cool stuff in there um go over here we have the uh, original rise of the ogre not in the best condition but i got it for like 80 bucks and those things still sell brand new for like 600 dollars or something um we have some other figures we have minato just a couple things this is an old toy from my childhood. This is a Power Rangers vehicle. Uh, yearbooks. We have stuff under there. Who cares? Uh, Gorilla's album on vinyl. We have uh, Ebony and Ivory, which again, my ex got me for Christmas. Uh, Halo CE pistol, which is a dart gun. We have a grunt drop pod with the grunt chilling right here. Minecraft Redstone Torch. We have Sweeney Todd's Shaving Razor. Uh, I have the old Seal of Orichalcos dual disc from when I was a kid. The OG boys. This thing is beat up. And ancient. But I still have it. And it's still mine. I still love it. Uh, coming down here, we got uh, Tales from the Gas Station Volume 1, 2, and 3. Happiness manga. Fantastic. If you like vampire gore, uh, happiness is great manga. We have the Alan Wake book. Um, we got the Roni Kenshin volumes. Alan's been sending me first two Bleach volumes. Supernatural, Book of Monsters, Ghouls. We have like a uh, Dad's Journals, a Bobby Singer's Guide to Hunting, rather. Fun stuff right there. Um, Supernatural poster. It's currently September. Gorillas again. Let's come on over here. Oh, man. I'm not even going to go over all my DVDs. I know, again, I'm sorry. It's dark. I'm not going to go over all of my DVDs, but I am going to basically just kind of uh, glide by them so you can see if anything catches your eye in my random DVD, anime, movie, VHS, whatever collection. I've got a whole bunch of stuff in here. Not obviously as impressive as a lot of other people's collections because I don't collect much anymore. But I do still like to pick up some DVDs and Blu-rays as I go along. Um, these are a bunch of CDs that I have, mostly Corner Gorillas. Then I have a whole bunch of other DVDs and stuff in there. Um, then we go over here. This is my Airsoft 
um, additional like extra patches right there. Uh, we have some stickers that Alan sent me that I put up here. That's the man himself. Uh, we have a whole lot of pins, a big old pin collection right here. A lot of those I used to get from Loot Crates. I picked up that Salem uh, planchette one when uh, me and Sam visited uh, Salem and for, like the witch trial museum and stuff. It was really cool. Yeah, fun stuff over there. And I think uh, outside of stuff that's in my basement and kind of, you know, whatever hanging out down there, that's most of the random cool, random allotment of cool stuff I have. I know if I go in my closet, um, I will find, here's another, uh, here's another sword. Actually, you know what? I'm going to put this over here. That's part of the backdrop now. That is a uh, Red Queen from Devil May Cry 4. Kind of put it in the closet and I forgot about it. Uh, is there anything else in here to quickly show? Um, man, oh man. Besides shirts and whatnot. I don't think so. I had more swords, I swear. Uh, what, what other swords am I missing? I'm missing my Zompok toe. Where's that? I know that's around here somewhere. Uh, I used to... Oh, you know why? I completely forgot. This right here is my <laughs> um, umbrella and cane basket by the door, which has... Some swords. This has a uh, Kisuke Urahara's uh, Benny Hime, which again is a uh, from Bleach. I've had that for a very long time. Over here we have Kenpachi Zaraki's Zanpakuto. I actually traded uh, my Bankai sword, my Tensei Zangetsu, for that down in Michigan. Uh, and then right here, I used to fucking. If you can't tell, I used to absolutely love Bleach. It was like my favorite anime when I was younger. Then this is Giant Zangetsu. And, um, oh, up here, I forgot about this. These are my very old Gorillas Converse. Didn't wear them that much because they were white, but I wore them enough, and they've just been kind of sitting on display enough for them to collect dust. So they're kind of dirty. And then I have this sword right here that I made. That's an actual bear's jaw that I mounted to the hilt, made with some random long sword, a couple of airsoft stock parts, and, uh, yeah. So... That right there is an assortment collection of random anime stuff. Sorry, I thought I heard something. I had to slow down for a second because I thought I heard something. I thought I heard something weird. What's inside? Oh, who knows? It's starting to rain. That's why. It's starting to rain. Anyways, so that's going to be it for this video. Oh, that's what I heard. It was the sink. It was the sink gurgling. Because I just started the washer and dryer. <laughs> I had the washer, rather. So I'm running a load of laundry. And it started gurgling out of the sink. That caught me completely off guard. Oh. It's really going. This is a Pirates of the Caribbean pendant that Alan sent me. I have a lot of random little trinkets that Alan has sent me. That have not had a solid place to be set up. And that are kind of in a box downstairs in the basement. I think there's a plane going overhead. Yeah, I hear a plane going overhead. That too. Um, let's see what else I can do. I'm just kind of going off the cuff now. Here's a gorilla's hat. Oh, how could I forget? The best thing we have, the best thing that I own. Dylan got me this for Christmas. How could I forget? Anyone else here like a Supernatural? Because that's a <laughs> Jared Padalecki and Jensen Ackles. Totally. <laughs> Almost naked. It's a pillowcase. And this is my official guest pillow. Dylan got me the, um, Supernatural stuff like that uh, for Christmas as a gag gift, but also it's just it's just it's fucking funny So now whenever I have a guest come over for the first time I say and here's your pillow and I hand them that pillow. So that's always it's always fun um, anyways That is gonna be it guys. Thank you all so much for watching if you enjoyed leave a like subscribe for more random Who cares content? I will see you all at some point Gesundheit